What is up, you guys? Almost Evil here, coming at you with a new type of segment. Uh, I'm going to call it the Episodic Series. It's where I take games that are more episode-based, more in decision-making. Where you at? Where you standing at morally with all your decisions that you're making and shit like that. Uh, as you can see, a lot of it's going to be the Telltale games and other games that just consist of this type of gameplay. I, I, don't, I don't even know how to like properly word that. These types of games are going to be what's in this. We're going to enjoy the episodes together. That way, we can enjoy talking to each other on the live streams. But I hope you enjoy. And if you do, don't forget to leave a like and comment down below on what game you might want me to do next. Otherwise, guys, thank you for the support. Let's get right on into it. To make him flinch. <laughs> well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Uh. Does it really matter? Does it really matter? Does it really matter? Nah, not much. Exactly. That's now, what I've I driven a thought. bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually, it's about now I get the I didn't do it. Uh, every time? every time? Every time. Use the right stick to look around. Now aim the target at the rear view mirror. Okay. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. Uh, you're from Macon. You're from Macon then. Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. I always wanted to work a murder case, like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real shame, that is. Oh. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. Uh, I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on a six year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? Uh, sure. I got much choice? Sure don't. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Or maybe she married the wrong guy! Oh, I thought oh, I thought he was gonna snap back. Never mind. <laughs> Any of that seem important to you? All of it, but that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I'm driving this man once. He, he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're sitting. Yeah, right here? Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. Not tell him he's got to stop. That's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. Yeah, so tase him! Stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. 
Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. He did it. So did he do, did it? do it? I know he did it. They caught the fucker red-handed. Stabbing fuck his on. wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Oh, foreshadowing. One this one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. Hey, whoa! Damn, the, the cop hit the zombie so fucking hard that the shit started to lag. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, this is not good. There is blood all over the seats. We are not going to be able to get these stains out. Sounds like they're having a lot of fun out there. Oh! It. Thirsty. Ah! Fuck! My leg! I wonder how many times, like, Lee's gonna wake up in this series, and that's how we're gonna... We're gonna start, like, a scene hey. or something. Hey, or, like, officer. end a scene. Are you alright? I'm you know still cuffed back here! Let's, let's leave a counter down there. So, uh. right now we're at one. Uh. Lee, sli uh, Lee, Lee sleep uh. counter. I need to drag myself out that window. Come on, Lee. All right, we got this. We got this. Officer? Officer? God damn. God damn. <laughs> it's, uh... Officer? Oh, hang on. No, hang on. God damn. God damn. It's like, uh... It's like when the guy who plays War Machine... I, I forgot his name. He was talking to Kevin Hart, and he told him his age. He's like, yeah, you know, being like 68. <laughs> and, the, and then Kevin Hart's like... Shit! <laughs> like, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, come on. Put that in this shit. S just stick it in, Lee. Jeez. J oh, God. That was such a- that was such a bad buffer. Officer. Oh, shit. Okay, back- We're going to back up. Back the fuck up. We're gonna back up. Back the, ooh, a shell. Get away from me! A shelly shell? Uh shotty a shotty gunny. Alright, grab the shotgun. Grab the shell, and now we're gonna put the shell inside of the shotgun. Lee, what the fuck, man? Alright, we're gonna we're gonna grab the shell and we're going to put it in the fucking shotgun. Don't make me do this! And we're gonna pop it. Nice. I was actually aiming for his toes, but I missed. I just murdered a man who was trying to eat me. What the fuck? What is that? Help! Go get someone! There's been a shooting! She's like, fuck that. <laughs> Little Clementine over there. Uh, fuck that shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh my god. Go. Oh man. How many? Are we gonna have to put a fall counter in there too? Alright, fine. Sleep and fall counters. Oh shit. I ha like I have to keep moving or else he'll stop. Oh my god, fall counter. That's on the fall counter. Does that count? Yeah, that counts. Ooh, 
Lee is bad at walking. I know he's got a leg injury, but he's bad at walking. Jeez. Fuck. Their one weakness. Wood. Oh. Alrighty. Hello? Anybody? Hello? Hello? <laughs> Just all it's all zoomed out. Hello? Is there anyone there? Oh, that just sounds like my Iron Man voice. Yeah, I can make myself sound like Iron Man. Hello? Anybody home? I need a little help. Oh, uh, fuck it. I'm just gonna open the door. Open says me. Coming in. Open Don't sesame shoot, seed. Okay? Don't shoot. Ah. Hello? I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. These people might need more help than I do. Oh, damn. Got this shit all over the walls? Okay, so like on a scale of 1 to 10, I want everyone to go down in the comments below and rate that picture. 1 out of 10. I'm gonna give it a 6. Oh, Jesus. oh god, someone had their period all over this floor. Oh my- Lee! What the hell? That, that goes on the fall counter. Damn it, man. Alright, time- Time for some good old fashioned The Last of Us looting. Here's some water. Imagine just like, why would why would you drink that though? Are you, are you really that thir like? You're not even gonna try to turn on the faucet. You're not even gonna try to do that. It's walkie talkie. Like, what if that had blood in it? What what if it? What what was it? What if it was stagnant? What if it what if it wasn't even water? What if it was vodka? Okay, maybe maybe it's maybe it's not a bad thing you did that. There's always that possibility. Oh, there's an answering machine. I'm gonna check the fridge though. That's a Savannah area code. But that's the type of note you'd leave a babysitter. Oh man. Now we know who had their period. There's something the beep there. There's the beeping. Furniture overturned, blood everywhere. Furniture's overturned. Jesus. Okay. Three new messages. Message one, left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra. This is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message two, left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby, if you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. Daddy? Huh? Uh, Hello? I don't have any children. You need to be quiet. Damn, she's already kind of bossy. I'm 
Not a monster. I'm not a monster. Good. Uh, uh, where are where your parents? Are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Where the boats are? Where are you? You ever been I'm around boats? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. What the fuck? What? Stop doing- Stop freezing like that! Oh, holy shit! Ew! Ew! Get off me! Hiya! Lee! Lee, what the hell, man? Why is this- Why is this- Why is this a thing? Get- Stop tripping! Lee, you're tripping, bro. Oh my god. Oh, you know, you can't have my shoes! Not my Air Jordans! Get out of me! Oh god. Da -na -na -na. Da -na. Hammer time! Da -na -na -na. Da -na 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 -na. Hammer time! Okay. Now can we talk? <laughs> Man. Hi there. Did you kill it? Probably not. I mean, yes. Yes. It's okay. I think she was a monster. I think so too. Yeah, did you see how she tried to steal You've been my shoes? All by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? Uh. Let's go out in the daytime. I'm pretty sure in the Walking Dead universe, it's the daytime. We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Yeah, see, that's what I thought. Let's go. It's Stay weird. It, it's me. weird. In some zombie universes, like, you want to go out at night, and other times, you don't. I mean, nine times out of ten, you don't. But like, I have seen ones where it's just like, you can't go out in the middle of the day because they can see you. It's like, oh shit, well, that's not good. Alright. We're chug, chug, chugging along. My name is Lee. I'm gonna look at this gate because it's got a hand on it. Oh shit! Civilization! Hello, neighbors! Oh, oh man! I ain't never getting home to mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. What? <laughs> what did he say? A touch dish night. <laughs> oh, I did not. Uh, I did not catch that at all. <laughs> what the fuck did he just say? What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? Uh, they won't. Let's go. go. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Oh no! I, they don't give you the option to like gently tell hey, her man. and explain to her. Holy shit! Don't eat us. We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. I thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. You know, if all this you stuff wasn't help. going on, that that'd have been kind of racist, bro. Because you should be. Those <laughs> things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen any. You're lucky that there's a zombie apocalypse. Since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. 
I'm not a dad. I'm... Uh, neighbor. I'm a neighbor. Her parents are out of town. Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. What do you want to do? I... The monsters come out. Oh. Leave me quick. Let's go. We're gonna push it. Push it to the limit. Push it to the limit. Uh, uh. Push it to the limit. Come on, Clementine. Push it to the limit. We're gonna push it to the limit. Okay, we're out of the way. Let's go. Alrighty. Any of those guys neighbors too? Yeah, probably a lot of them. I, I actually didn't live here. Anyways, we're out of five thousand, my friends. Roads, take me home to the place. The zombies on. Yeah, the hoes, they want to know the address like hey, door I'm gonna run on home. My mom is going to be in a snit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. Bye, Chet. I won't remember you. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. What if I just like... You've brought a couple guests. Uh, um, uh, Your boy's uh, a lifesaver. Yep, glad yep, your boy's a lifesaver. So it's just you and your daughter then? Oh, not his daughter. He was her neighbor. Oh! Uh, do you oh. know this man? Yes. Okay, then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, I think It's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You take a seat up on the porch, and I'll go see what I have. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Uh, uh, it, it hurts like hell. It hurts like hell. I bet it does. What did you say your name was? Uh, it's, Lee. it's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. How'd this happen? Car accident. I'm just car okay. Accident. So to be real, That's I'm just gonna so. be as honest as I can. Where are you headed before the car accident? I'm just gonna handle these situations like I would handle them in real life to the best of my ability. I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about on the road. Who are you with? The girl? No, a police officer. I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem... Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we got to reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Uh, Your son's right. You're yeah. going to want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. Dead people walking. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. 
Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. Ah, uh, here it comes. I knew we'll it. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Oh, okay. okay. I thought, okay. That'd be Never preferable. Mind. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. All right, then. Fuck me in the peepee. -pee. Wait, what? Here we go. It smells like... Uh, uh... Manure. Yeah. Manure? Like when a horse plops? Yep. Just like that. You're not allowed to say shit until you're... How old are you? My mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Ah, pretty far. Oh, okay. Oh, she fell asleep like directly. Okay. I love you, baby. <laughs> Hey, get up. Hey, <sighs> get up. Oh, I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? Like I'm right over top of Lee's face, dad. I'm sorry. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, yeah. we're in the middle of a just... fence. There's a tractor and everything. Shut the fuck up, duck. We better get going or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Dodging or quacking? Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad! See? The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Oh, like penis heads. I'll see what the girl would like. Ah, gotta consult the missus. I understand. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. All right, good. That's what I wanted. That's all I wanted. All right, time to fucking talk to people. Hey there, girls. So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I, I murder used to teach people. up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. No, I used to. I was let go a little while back. That's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. <laughs> How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just... Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then I can't take away the things we... The things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? <sighs> this could all be providence, you know? Not what we saw. You just never realize when something is happening to you, what you're being given. Maybe this will all work out. Your optimism is 
refreshing. New, these past couple days at least. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. So, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Back in a bit. Alright. Let me go talk to Kenny really like quick. All right, dude. <laughs> he seems like an alright dude. Let me go talk to him. Let me go engage in conversation with this man. <laughs> hey there, uh, Kenny. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I'm okay. I think I've got it handled okay. As long as I keep her safe, I think I'm doing all right. With those things out there, maybe. Sure, that's enough. But you gotta ask yourself if you're the type of guy who can do better than that if her parents don't show up. I'll keep that in mind. What's How's your plan? Your oh, I should I Good, the wrong I think. One. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. Uh, we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. So what's, what's your family's plan? plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could... Hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. See you. <laughs> the boat's not that bad. All right, see you. Later, bro. Oh, a fucking tree. Get out of my way, Mr. Trick. Get out of my way. I hate it when trees are just all on my way like that. How you like, doing, Duck? Like, who Good. put that there? I'm gonna drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. <laughs> nice. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Luckily, I can play My this game with one hand. Dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. You gotta do what you gotta do. Was the boy one of the walkers? <laughs> I don't even know. You gotta do what you gotta do, bro. Guy asking for help. He didn't even hesitate. See? He just turned, oh, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. We're just talking like this in Did front of Doug, just no regard to what? <laughs> Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh. Um. Sometimes. Uh, I bet. I could uh, shoot one. Yeah. I could shoot one. Maybe. If it were far away. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad I mean, just wants to keep I mean, the family safe. Really and thinks inviting choose. people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? I don't know. Well, not too close with my family. Oh. Well, they weren't in Atlanta, right? So that's good. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. And Sean? He even hit me. <laughs> no problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he can That was totally sus, bro. Anyways, love you, baby. Alright. Let's go see what let's go see what Mr. Green's got going on. Hey yo, what 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 the fuck? What the fuck? Okay, there we go. I, I keep forgetting I gotta use the analog stick. 
How'd you get out of Atlanta? I was, uh, I... I was on my way out anyway. The timing of all this just happened to be right. Huh. If there ever is a good time for the supposed apocalypse. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? Uh, my parents are making. Parents are in with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. Oh, there's a fly in here. But now you've got this little like girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Yeah. I was looking for help in her house. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. But you better become a better liar and fast. What? Let's say things don't get better back in the cities. What the they fuck? They get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And oh, if those say people get to okay. questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. So whoever you are and whatever you did, keep it to your damn self. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. So wait, is he telling me to lie? Is he... I don't no, want to... Man, that's, that's ambiguous. Ambiguous. Oh, shit. Oh my god, duck. Duck, what the hell, man? Oh shit. Oh shit! No! Oh fuck! I'm I'm saving the kid first. I'm sorry. I'm saving the kid first. Ah! Fuck you, Mr. Zombie! Oh shit, I thought I was gonna grab Duck. I, I guess I'm just decking him in the face. Oh, oh bitch! Oh, now we're fucked. Yeah, I mean, I'm working for that too. I'm not sure what we stood around for so long. Oh, shit. How can they bite through pants? Oh. <laughs> I like how some of them head don't explode, but that one's dead. Ah! 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 There's a fly! Or a moth. Moth man. Mothman, is that you? Get out. Get the fuck out of here! I'm sorry. Sorry? Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. And you, you didn't even try to help. Uh, Doc, I thought I, I thought I could help them both. Look at him. You thought wrong. And now? Please. Just go. Get out and never come back. Uh. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. I misread that signal. Got that ride to make it if you want it. I mean, we don't we don't really have much of a fucking choice at this point. Country road. Oh wait, hang on, hang on. Uh. Country road. Well, this is as far as we're going. Then it's far to enough. The play Where I belong! Okay, now I'm done. Drug! Drugstore! Hey, uh, you know where to get some medicine? Yeah, the drugstore! Hey there! You friendly? 
Trucks run out of gas. Fuck! Yeah, if you see someone like slouched over and it seems like they're eating something off the ground, they're probably not friendlies. <laughs> Shit! Run. Eagle Eye Carly! <gasps> and ball clap! Uh, ball, ball clap! <laughs> ball cap Glenn! So for those of you who don't know, uh, this is connected with the uh, Walking Dead comic universe, and that's why it looks the way it does. Well, that and also because, you know, Telltale. We can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die, either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? We have kids with us. I see one little girl. Oh, you're about to say one foot in your ass! What is it? I... I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. Then just go! Oh, jeez, shit! I wasn't trying to say it like that, god damn! I don't care. Maybe you should go join him then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. She's not wrong. They took a risk. Yes, we did. And we appreciate it. Now let's settle down. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. What? He I wasn't bitten. I don't think he was Hell bitten. he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no Jesus. bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! We, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's uh, just Kick his a ass? I'm, I'm not even gonna lie to you. I'd, I'd beat the shit out of this dude. You need to calm down. We kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. Everyone chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not bitten. Lee, stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting Yeah, sit down alive. or else, bitch. Sit down. That's it. You're gonna whoop me? <laughs> you and what homo parade? This one. <laughs> That's good. No, no, the Kenny, I, okay. Before you eat <laughs> your body, you can Kenny, watch your dad. Kenny, it's not helping. Broken. I'm gonna kill him, cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee. Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Clementine, I'm trying to have an altercation. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. Jesus, then we'll then just we deal, deal with, with it then. But right now, we're just freaking everybody out. Then get ready to deal with it, because that boy is bitten. not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now. Do we not have any firepower? Man, fuck him up. Knock this guy out. Happily. Oh. Jesus. Oh. oh, man. Damn it, Kenny. I, I was really betting on you, man. Oh, Kenny, wake up! We need oh, he is oh, okay. We need your redneck strength next time. Oh shit! No! Fuck you! No! This is not how I wanted things to turn out. Yeah! Fuck! Oh my god! Oh shit! Thanks, Carly. He almost kissed me. You okay? Just great, thanks. Uh, guys? Everybody down! Stay quiet! They're gonna get in! Shut up! I don't know. Thank 
God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, Dad! Ah! <laughs> Life alert! <laughs> What's wrong? Maybe he was bitten. What's wrong with him, though? What's wrong with him? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. Mm, okay, we'll, we'll do it. There's probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. There's shit in there I need, office. too. Huh, huh, huh. Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You know your way around town, huh? You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. All right, let's get it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like on this video, and also subscribe, and don't forget to leave a comment down below on what game you might want me to do next. I love you guys. Thank you for all the support you've been giving me. But as always, we're going to end it with the bro fist. I'll see y'all in the next video. Click over. Bye-bye!